lovelies. So today I had something wonderful planned for y'all, but as days go, didn't pan out. But um, we thought my dad was doing a lot better, but it just ended up that his kidney stone was just shifting and he had to be go to urgent care this afternoon. I didn't get to go and it probably was a good thing because I started violently throwing up. So that's always a really super fun time and I am exhausted. So hopefully I'll go to sleep tonight and wake up tomorrow and it'll be a brand new day. Only insomniacs say that. Usually you just say, hopefully I wake up tomorrow and it'll be a brand new day. You don't add the sleep tonight and then wake up. Because that's just implied for normal human beings. But look at the things that happened before all of that. A freaking thing. That was 350. Yeah. This is actually what I just bought it for because I have this junky junk, but I want to do my whole face white and this is just a lot easier and to get like a thinner layer of it so you don't have like caked on white. Oh yeah, I was right in the middle of painting my nails too. So this side is done, but this side needs another coat and I got these adorable little stickers to put on them. I don't think you're going to be able to see them. You can! Look at me being all pessimistic. Yeah, and you put those little stickers on and I was just going to paint over top of it. I thought it'd be so cute, but my body had other intentions. But this was kind of cool. It comes with, like fake scar, tooth out, fake blood, horror, flesh, cream makeup, these four colors, these bullet looking things. I don't know. I used makeup. Um, but yeah, I haven't done face makeup like this in so freaking long. I don't know how long it's been. So I went to get this and it came with all this other cheap crap that I'll never use. But as an American consumer, I purchased it thinking, wow, look at this other, all of the rest of this crap I get, even though I just want this one thing right here. And it probably was one that well, there was one for a clown, but I couldn't look directly at it. So I'm guessing they probably had white makeup in there, but we'll never know. We just will never, ever know. Because you should not look directly at a clown. Just so you know, I'm not a crazy person. We went on the hayride, which I couldn't get any footage of because I freaking forgot that there's no light on my camera plus it's really embarrassing to have a light on the entire time so it was nighttime so I couldn't take any footage but anyways a freaking girl directly across from us punched a girl a, a clown in the in the nose in the nose and it was a girl clown too so we have like softer faces so she could have broke that girl's nose I didn't hurt the man that I hit mm -mm. So that was kind of, it was like not nice, but Lindsay told me anytime that there was a clown, which was pretty much the entire freaking ride. What is it with clowns now? Like I can't watch my American Horror Show, like I can watch some of it and then I know when that like tinkling noise happens of the like Jack in the Box, I have to like cover it up and evidently he's going to be a long character. So I'm going to have to do that every freaking time. It's like ridiculous for a grown woman to be like going like this in my room by myself in the middle of the day. Oh, it's so weird and irrational. But guess who was a big girl and got her flu shot today? Yeah. I've only gotten sick one time when I got my flu shot because people with fibro have immune issues which means we pretty much get freaking every kind of sickness. And even though this is a, not a live vaccine, the flu is not a flu shot is not a live vaccine. Sometimes people with really um, low immune systems can still have a reaction to it. Usually I just get like a big huge bump on my arm, which is like no bigs. But one year I got like the 
flu chills or something. I don't know. I've never actually had the flu because uh, one year I tried not to get the flu shot and my mom started crying and I've never actually seen her properly cry and that was the first time so I was like, okay, fine, yes. Um, so she knows that works on me so she's going to probably use it at some point but I have really bad asthma. I just don't talk about it a lot because I'm a little insecure about it but I have really bad um, if you have Instagram sometime, I, I think I Instagram a picture, maybe I just Snapchatted it. I don't know, maybe I wasn't ready yet, but if I'm doing my nebulizer, I'll take a picture of it, but it just still is like kind of like a dorky thing. You're not, like, I, it's not actually a dorky thing, but it's like perceived that way, so. Anyways, back to the clown. So she hit the clown, I said, don't worry, like last year I did the same thing, and I said, you know, I have a rational fear of clowns. And she was like, no, I wasn't like that. I'm not like really afraid of clowns. It's just because they, they come up onto the thing where the hayride is. It's not actually like a hayride. Well, at least not from where I'm from. Like you actually sit on hay, hay bales. But there's like a railing and they jump up on the railing and he like put his head around. And when she turned, his head was like right there. And so she went, ah, and like hit him in the face her in the face but um so this is his fault but we had a lot of fun on that I'm glad that you guys really liked the vlog footage that I put together one night when I was really really sick um what else um I got glitter and I got got glot eyelashes I got pretty dull eyelashes because um, I'm thinking about doing a sugar skull, which is, I mean, I haven't done anything like it in ages, so I shouldn't be like, oh, it's so easy, and then I'll go to do it, and I'll be like, oh my gosh, this looks horrible, but it's generally easy because you can do it as easy or as hard as you want, but I thought these eyelashes would look really cool. I thought they would look really cool with anything as well, but I wanted to do a person with fibro, but nobody put that in the comments. But I also was like talking to my mom and I was like, yeah, I want to do a person that has fibro, but you know, also they could be like just a generic, like crazy person, asylum, zombie looking person. And then she just like looked at me and I just bust out laughing. And then I was like, I get it. I just got it. I'm one of those people. But, um, that's kind of what I look like sometimes. <laughs> Um, but anyway, so if you guys still have ideas, I haven't done the tutorial yet, um, because I'll probably film it and then it'll take me freaking till after Halloween to edit it, um, and I'll probably film it sometime soon, but I haven't yet, so let me know down below, uh, if there's any Halloween tutorial that you're interested in seeing me do, I don't know, uh, what other cool things happened today? Besides throwing up and my dad having to go to urgent care. And by the way, it was because he didn't pass his stone. So, I don't know if I mentioned that. I just hope I can sleep, y'all. Oh, the most exciting thing. Why Bella's right here. Usually Bella doesn't sit on my lap like this. She did last time because she was just being annoying. When I had to like yell at her with my eyes. Usually she makes a like cave over here. Sometimes you can see her head pop up. Um... But I got, I have this fleece that I got at like Dollar General, I don't know, a year, two, a year ago. And it's her favorite fleece. But it just so happens to be my favorite fleece. And they're not big. They're not like big, huge throws. They're like, I can, you can see them in the camera. So it sucks when she gets like all comfy in it. And I'm like, just a little bit. Because I sleep with them under my neck so that my neck doesn't hurt. Well, Mama went to Dollar General, General, and I got this. It's like this. I don't. This is really gonna be interesting. Me explaining this. It's like that, like lamby, lamby lamb on that side. Oh, what was that like sock? Little lamb. Does anybody remember that? It was something pork chop. Does anybody remember Pork Chop? In the comments down below, let me know if you remember the kids' show Pork Chop. It was literally a puppet lamb. And that was like the entire show. That's maybe that's where like my fear of like dolls and clowns came from. 
Anyways, and then it's just this like gray fuzzy stuff in the in here. And my dog is obsessed. Yeah. Yo, have you moved from the fleecy? Yo, the mom is so comfy. I'm so happy. Yep, she's really happy. Um, but it's really nice and comfy, so now we both can have a fleece. Bella loves her fleecies. Yeah. Um, I got lots of other stuff. That's why I'm looking around my room, but they're presents, so I'm not going to show them. But I got a present, and I haven't even opened it, and I already made my day. It was definitely, definitely, I mean, the bar was real low, but even if my bar was real high, it would have made my day. And I wanted to show it to you guys, but obviously I can't even be coherent today. Lammy lamb, lamb chop. Did I say that? See, I don't, oh my gosh, wow. Uh, other thing I wanted to tell you guys still, if you didn't check it out in any of my other videos, is Sephora is doing a mix and match. I don't get anything from this. I don't, like, oh my gosh. <laughs> I just hit my own glasses. Just rewind that and watch it again because I'm not going to edit this. Um, I don't get anything from it or like, I don't, it's just really cool. I play it every single day. And you either get 10% off um, an item or 150 beauty points. So go do it. And if you want to order something, just do it on the day that you get 10% off. That's what I did. Last order I did, I did it on a 10% off day. And I got like $25 off my order because I ordered a crap ton of stuff. But, uh, la, 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 yeah, just prayers for my dad. That's really it. And I guess prayers for me, too. I am really bad about asking for prayers. Because it feels very selfish, but it's not. And, um, thank you guys so much for the comments. I don't, I don't know. I could thank you guys every single day for the comments. They just mean the world to me. Ugh. I just would feel so alone if I didn't have them. And... And you know what I was realizing I'm so hype, uh, what's the word, hypocritical, is because I don't, I tr I've been trying to push myself, and you probably on my Google Plus will notice that I've been commenting a lot more on people's videos, but I don't comment on people's videos, because I generally don't have anything cool to say, like I'm always just like, great video, you're the best. Like, that's it. That's all I get. So, um, I think that I just am like, I don't know why. I know how much it means to me, even if someone says, hi, H-I. I'm like, awesome! What a cute comment! But, like, for me, I'm like, after a novel. Um, no, I don't know. But I am going to hopefully go to sleep now. I'm going to upload this and then hopefully go to sleep. That's probably not going to happen, but we can hope. And I hope you guys are having a pain free stress free day. Don't forget to let me know down in the comments down below what Halloween tutorial you would like. And I will combine as many as I can because in my household, I was a vampire ballerina one year. Um, we combined things just because we took a ballerina ballet costume and then I had some vampire teeth and fake blood and so that's what I was. I was a vampire ballerina and no one ever knew what I was. Um, and sending out X double O's <laughs> this little one and as always I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye!